Hi guys, welcome back to my channel, Unique Tarot. This is going to be messages, a oracle read for the collective, okay? This is an oracle read for the collective, all right? We're gonna see what comes out collectively for the um, collective, okay? Carry the energy here. Let's get into it. I have to burn some um, Papa Santos here. Okay. Clear the energy, clear the decks here so that we can get into it. A Scorpio could be significant here, okay, for some of you. Or you could be a Scorpio or dealing with one or whatever, okay? for my messages first and then we're going to get into the oracle of the other decks here what's the messages here for the collective at this time what's the messages here for the collective at this time messages what's significant here for the collective to know at this time could be dealing with a virgo okay okay we have the murder card here I'm getting spirit. That's significant. So a murder could have taken place here or it's going to. What's the messages here for, for the collective? Okay. The neighbors are listening. I've been getting that card a lot. Okay. Okay. We have stocks, bonds, Forex trading. We have lotter lottery winnings. A Libras, I'm getting something specifically for Libras. You're on a you're on a very lucky streak here. The lottery should be something that you should play. Okay. You're the love of my life. Okay. What's the messages here? Some of you can should invest in stocks as well. We have Taurus. A Taurus could be significant here. We have soulmate. So somebody feels like you're the love of their life, their soulmate here, okay? And we have BDSM. This is somebody you like to do BDSM with, or they like, or they like to do it with you, or whatever. Some of you could be into BDSM. Okay. Yeah, we got stabbed in the back. So this card was originally stabbed, and we have murder. So somebody could have been stabbed here. Or someone could be plotting to murder someone by stabbing them. I have to give the messages. All right. I never loved you came out. And we have bad karma. Okay. I'm getting somebody's getting bad karma for not loving the, the, the way that they were supposed to. Now someone sees you as the love of their life and their soulmate. But somebody pretended like they never loved you or never cared about you. They do. Yeah, deep love. Somebody has deep love for you. Okay, just period. Yeah, too, you're too good for me. You could be too good for this person in demotion. Yeah, I'm getting somebody got demoted or someone feels that way. Okay, I will never be faithful to you. It's here. All right, and we have... Um, so, somebody here will never be faithful. Just know that. We have hate. Yeah. Okay. The number 222, all right, and pervert. Somebody's a pervert. They can never be faithful because they're a goddamn pervert. They have to fuck everything that they see because they have very low self-esteem about themselves. I'm so obsessed with you. Yeah, but this is someone who's obsessed with you, though. Okay, period. You're the love of their life. They're soulmate. They're deeply in love with you, but they want to pretend like they never loved you. This was someone who who doesn't want. This is someone who doesn't want to be faithful to you. Yeah, bisexual. This could be someone that's bisexual as well. 
that likes both men and women. All right. Yeah, we have, it's a setup. I'm getting somebody's trying to set someone up to, to murder them as well. So be careful. This could even be a neighbor. It doesn't have to be. All right, with the star card here, and I did see the star seed card. Somebody is a star seeded, a star. You could be dealing with the Sagittarius, okay? All right, that's an alcoholic with the alcoholic card, okay? I'm getting somebody's bad hygiene. I'm getting somebody is um ancestors is, is drinking a lot. They lost this love. They're depressed. They're drinking a lot. They're not taking care of themselves, okay, at all, just period. All right, somebody's trying to pretend like they never loved you or cared or that they don't care that you're gone. They do care every second of every fucking day. Yeah, bad health. Someone's in bad health here and bad hygiene. Okay. It says, when I betrayed you, I betrayed myself. Okay. And it says you were right about this person. So you could have warned them about somebody that they chose over you or stayed with or whatever the fuck. And you, that now they're seeing you were 100% right about this person. Okay. Meditate more. I'm getting somebody is spending a lot of time. Uh, yeah, proposal and astrologer. I'm getting somebody meditates a lot. Somebody could be an astrologer. Somebody could be a palmistress. So, I, cause I seen that card too. Somebody's a star in the public eye. I'm getting a psychic energy here. Okay. I'm getting somebody wants to pr propose to you now or make some kind of proposal towards you. All right. Let's see. I'm only going to pull a few more before I move on to the other decks here. We have broke. Yeah, somebody is broke. And repossession. Somebody's car is getting repossessed or something because someone doesn't have the money here. Okay? To do what they need to do. Yeah. I know somebody don't, don't, don't want to propose and they broke. Fuck out of here. Okay, yep. There's star seed and star. So somebody's a star here. Or they're going to be. Somebody's in bad health and they lost a lot of weight with this with this um card here. We have dark night of the soul. Yeah, somebody's going through a dark night. We have the number 888. A lot of abundance. I'm seeing that number a lot. So, yeah, feds are involved. So somebody could be dealing with the feds here. Yeah, black magic. Okay. So if you told somebody that someone was doing black magic on them with you were right about this person card here and the black magic, you were right about this person. If you told them that someone was doing black magic on them, you told them right. Or if you feel that someone is doing it on you or did it on you, you're right. Okay. And somebody could be into real estate. This could be someone into a real estate, a Sagittarius or a Scorpio. Or that somebody is in somebody's into real estate and forex trading and bonds and stocks with the stocks and bond card here. This is someone that's a pervert or has a sexual addiction here. You're a star, and this person now sees you as the love of their life. Maybe BDSM. Maybe you could have told this person you like BDSM, or they told you that. Okay. I'm getting somebody's drinking a lot too because of this loss. So we'll get a couple more before we move on to another deck. Okay, I'm getting somebody regrets highly stabbing you in the back. A Leo could be significant, and here goes Scorpio. So Sag and Scorpio is here, and Leo and Virgo. So I'm getting it's one of those signs or somebody on the cuffs. Okay, somebody a forex trader or into real estate, but somebody's broke though. They're not doing well. Okay, I'm getting somebody else is doing very well. We have I'm I'm fucking him or her, but thinking of you. So they're thinking of you while they're with this person. Because they're probably sexually unsatisfied. Okay. Just period. What's the messages? What's the messages? All right. And we're taking these last two. And um, yeah, tarot card reader. And I love when we do 69. Okay. Tarot card reader. Somebody could be, and we have little boobies. Yeah, somebody's jealous that you're a tarot card reader. Yeah, polygamy. Somebody wants you to put put be put in a, pol uh, a polygamous situation and you're not. Period. And you know that they're trying to because you're a tarot reader, you're a psychic. All right. We have, I'm being haunted every day. Yeah, dark night of the soul and healing sex. So somebody finds you to have healing sex. Okay. And somebody's being haunted by their actions or decision that they chose every day. Because they chose, they made the wrong decisions here. All right, let's pull from this Oracle deck. Sorry, guys. Let's pull from this deck here. 
for the spirit guys, spirit guys, angels, universe, so the white light. What's the messages here for the collective? What's the messages? Yeah, I'm getting somebody who's really regretful. Now someone sees you as the love of their fucking life and all this shit. Now that you've moved on. Okay, what's the messages here for the collective? What's the messages for the collective? What's the messages to, to clarify this energy that's here? What's the messages? We have blessed. This fell out earlier, so you're very blessed. I'm getting somebody else's not. Okay, we have breathe, all right? Um, yeah, and we have happy, happy. I'm getting you breathe easy. You sleep well at night. You're happy. You're blessed. Somebody, you have support with the leg up card and you have all that glitters, a lot of abundance around you, a lot of happiness. Yeah, the tribe. Yeah, your ancestors are around you, protecting you. Unfinished symphony and yang. Yeah, this masculine energy. This is yang, masculine energy. Feels like they have unfinished business with you here. You're the love of their life. Yeah, but I'm getting your not for them with the not for you. You don't feel like this person is for you. They treated you the way they did and it's, and it's over with. Yeah, co-create. It's time for you to co-create with someone else here. Not with this Scorpio or Sagittarius. This Leo or this Virgo. Yeah, we have truth be told in the reverse because this person isn't an honest person. They don't tell the truth. They're a liar. Yeah, we have a change in the wind and flexible. Yeah, you've, you've, you've relocated or moved or you don't want to be with this person. Okay, now that or now somebody wants to co-create and be with you. Yeah, to be fair. Now somebody wants to be fair or tell the truth or they know they lied or they want to bounce. They, they want to change their ways or the, somebody that was not willing to bend. Now they want to bend. Now they want to be more flexible. Now they want to see things from your perspective more or now they're will. Now they are seeing it. Yeah, serendipity. It's like they've had some kind of epiphany here. Okay. Yeah. After meditating or having time. Yeah. The, the four of the. The time for a nap, that's four swords. The orphan card, that's the five of cups, okay? Or the five of pentacles, I'm sorry, and chopped wood, yeah. Now somebody's realizing after going through a dark night of the soul with the dark night of the soul card and um, being haunted, they're being haunted by the thought that they lost you, yeah. Deep knowing is in reverse, not for you, yeah. You're, you're, you know that this person isn't for you. Someone here knows, yeah, soulmate. Somebody knows, yeah, deep knowing, that this person isn't for you just at all somebody here wasn't willing to listen to their intuition and they lost out on a love yeah building blocks now somebody wants to start over and be, rebuild yeah to the sea but i'm getting someone has moved on to a new love look at that loyal heart six of swords this is the six of swords card moving on in the regular day and loyal heart is like a twin flame so we have soulmate here and twin flame so a soulmate relationship is over with that somebody lost out on now i'm getting you're going towards your twin flame and you deserve this okay it's yours you deserve it this this person from the past is just fucked up it is what it is yeah clean it up all right, I'm getting you cleaned out the past. You're getting rid of people, places, things that no longer serve you, and you're moving on. Yeah, imagine you've you've manifested a new life for yourself. That's the manifest manifestation. Yeah, and this is the Wheel of Fortune card with the TikTok card. That's the Wheel of Fortune. You are destined to do something different and be with someone different. Yeah, exchanging gifts. I'm getting a lot of gifts here. I'm getting you have a lot of gifts. I'm getting the number six six six. It's significant. All right. So let's move on and get a couple cards from this deck. Messages for the collective. What is the messages here for the collective, please, spirit? This is or this is an oracle read for the collective. Okay. Messages here for the collective, please. Spirit guides, angels, universe. What's the messages here for the collective? What's the messages here for the collective, please? Here. What's the messages here for the collective? Okay. What's the messages here for the collective, please? Give me some messages from the beautiful, beautiful vintage wisdom oracle deck here. Okay. This is too many. 
please. Okay, yeah, we have change. We're changing the wind. There's a lot of changes happening. We have gratitude that you're gr very grateful for and nature. A lot of you need to go out in nature more or you're starting to. Maybe you're going out to hug trees or put your feet in grass or stand in the rain or whatever. What's the messages here for the collective? Oracle messages for the collective. Please, spirit. Oracle messages for the collective. We have innocence. Yeah, six of cups. So, and we have um, ancestors. Yeah, I'm getting, uh, I'm getting your ancestors are really around you. You have always been covered and protected by your ancestors since you were a little child. I'm getting a past life relationship too with someone that's coming in here. This could be someone at a distance that you're about to be involved with. Okay. Okay. We have peace. Yeah, you're at peace. You're at peace with the past too and letting it go. You've cleared that out. You have a deep understanding that it's time to move on with your life, whether somebody else understands that or not. Yeah, we have faith. You've kept the faith of lie. You imagine and you, you manifest it. We have protection. You're very protected here. Your ancestors and protection. That's beautiful. Let me, let me show y'all those cards. Just so motherfuckers who think they doing this magic and shit, it ain't working. Okay. We have power and ancestors. Your ancestors are very powerful. And we have, well, this is protection. Your ancestors protect you. They're very powerful. Okay. I wouldn't be surprised if the powerful card doesn't come out. Okay. You've been awesome. You've, you're chosen is what I'm getting. You're at peace and you have faith in yourself. We have balance. Okay. You're very balanced at peace. You have purity. It's a, someone here has a very pure, innocent soul. It's very pure. You have strength. And you're very strong. I'm getting your ancestors that protect you are very strong too. What's the messages here? Okay. We have awakening. That card keeps coming out today. So a lot of somebody's very awakened here in grace. You're very graceful. Okay. Very truthful, very honest, very pure in your soul. Very pure energy here. Okay. We have love. Okay, lots of love surrounds you, and we have adventure. I'm getting a lot of you could be taking a trip or you love to travel. Okay, any additional messages before we close this out? Okay, any additional messages? What was that? Okay, healing, yeah, and we have a uh, sanctuary. So you're very at peace at where you are and who you have choices. You're very happy with the choices you're making in your life. And because of that, you're meeting kindred spirits, people who follow your same path, who support you, who you can trust with the trust thought card. You get what I'm saying? Because you did the shadow work. You've worked on the, your shadow self. You've done the work here. Or you are willing to do the work. And because of that, you're truly best. Yeah, union and shadow self. You're coming into union with your divine counterpart because you've done the work on your shadow self. You've set good intentions for yourself. You made good choices, okay? Just period. And because of that, you win. Yeah, you're free to do and have whatever you want, okay? Okay, just period. So those are those messages. All right. This is the oracle reading for the collective. Let's see. What's the messages here for the collective, please? What is the messages here for the collective? I'm getting an energy of really moving on in your life, really making good cho choices and being very, very happy because you, you listen to your inner self. And you followed instructions by your ancestors and spirit guides. And for that, you're very protected. And, and um, very, very loved here. We have get your head out of your ass pronto. It's dark and you don't see a fucking thing. Yeah, I'm getting you're not you're not in your ass. You've come out. Vulnerability is hot as fuck. Yeah, drop the fucking ego. I'm getting your you you. I'm getting there's somebody here that that wants to come back towards you. That knows they have to take their head out of their ass. They gotta drop the fucking ego. They gotta be vulnerable. They gotta be honest and they gotta be truthful in order to to be able to say a fucking word. To you. And even then, I'm getting something is over. But it, at least then, you know, in order to even do that, they have to be honest because somebody's a liar. This person that's holding on to you and that can't seem to let you go, that's getting their shit repossessed and, and living a very tired out life, 
that chose all these other beings over you and all this other shit. Now they stuck. Yeah, fuck them. They broke your heart. Yeah, this is someone who broke your heart or someone who tried to because I'm getting someone that's very evil. But I'm getting you bossed up. You didn't, Your heart didn't break because you didn't want this raggedy motherfucker. I'm getting you bossed up. Instead, now their heart is broken. Spend your, spend your time on someone worth it. Don't waste it on ridiculous, ridiculousness. Stop texting. Stop stalking. Stop checking on that person. Just, just fucking stop. Yeah, I'm getting you don't care about this person. You're not watching them. You don't stalk. I'm getting they're watching you, though. A lot. Okay, your body is pissed at you. It says, get the fuck outside, move your ass. I'm getting somebody's depressed here. They 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 have bad hygiene. They've lost weight. They're not, they're in ill health here. We got, go uh, go easy on your ass. Buy your own damn drink. Yeah, you are the best thing to ever happen to you. I'm getting yourself, somebody here self-sufficient, self-reliant. They're abundant. They're doing exactly what they're meant to do. Somebody else knows that and they're mad. And they're wishing they could be a part of that with you. Okay. Damn, how did I mix these cards like this? Okay. Let's get a couple more before we move on. All right. Let's get a couple more of these for the collective. What's a couple more of these, please? For the collective, what's the messages? Messages for the collective. Come on. Okay, we got forgive, let that shit go. Shame, regret, guilt, those are just bullshit. Yeah, somebody's in shame, regret, guilt. They want you to forgive them, but they need to be, they know they have to be vulnerable, honest, and truthful. Yeah, make it rain, money. I knew that car was coming out. Somebody got that bread. Somebody feels shame and guiltful because you're happy, you're abundant, you're beautiful, you're blessed. You're, you're a star with the star seed and star card here. You're, you're celebrated, you're a tarot card reader, psychic, whatever, and they're not. Okay, we have everyone has their turn. Welcome to yours. Gather your tired ass up and handle it. You are going through some tough shit. Yeah, they're going through tough shit. Somebody's tired, weighed down, burdened in their life. Yeah. Yeah, it says loosen the fuck up. Control freaks don't get laid. Yeah, you equals tight ass. Somebody's realizing that controlling shit, that possession shit, the games, the, the stupid evil shit they've been doing. That ain't nobody studying that shit. Yeah, seriously, just do it. Fucking apologize. Somebody knows they need to fucking apologize. They know they need to be vulnerable and honest. They're not willing to do that. That's why they're a fucking loser. That's why they're bottom of the barrel and you're over here winning a star and everything else. It says if you're waiting for a sign, here the fuck it is. Um... What the hell are you waiting for? Get that shit done. Yeah, somebody is getting all the signs that they need to apologize and come correct, but they don't want to. Okay, I'm getting someone's not eating or anything. They're depressed, losing weight, everything. And then we have, it says, um, the world needs your power, your use your voice. Just don't use it for dumb shit. You are talented and fucking amazing. Somebody's a star, world renowned. You're talented, you're amazing, you have gifts. You're a star seed. Yeah, it says you got a good thing going. Don't ruin that shit. Winning. Yeah, you're winning. Period. In the money card, you're abundant. It says make it rain right here. Somebody else is not. Yeah, love. Somebody's in love with you. And they're depressed because you don't want their ass no more. Period. So let's get a couple messages from the uh, tea leaf deck here. This is for the collective. What are the messages? Someone will try to make you do something against your will. Like, yeah, somebody's trying to get you to fuck with them, but they're not willing to be honest. They want to win. They want to be in the higher position. They, But they're broke. With broke cards, shit getting repossessed. The feds are involved. Somebody here got somebody pregnant. All types of stupid ass shit. We have um, Target. Yeah, a great, a goal-oriented person. Yeah, you're goal-oriented. And every mark you set, you hit, bitch. Dead in the motherfucking middle. This person know that. All right, what's the messages here for the collective? What's the messages here for the collective, please? All right, we have Vine. Yes, yeah, seek out information that will help you. Yeah, okay. And then I'm getting somebody needs your help too. It says shield. You need to defend yourself. Yeah, but I'm getting you got a shield up or you're defending or you blocking this person. You don't give a fuck if they need your help. They didn't care if, if you ever needed something. They didn't give a fuck. They may even laugh that you or love to see you down. Now somebody needs your help, and I'm getting you don't need two fucks. We have shark. Take care, or there will be loss of material wealth. Yeah, somebody lost a lot of money because they were a snake. They tried to, the same hole they dug for you, they fell in. We have feathers. Someone you know is undependable and insecure. Yeah, somebody's undependable, unreliable. They're insecure. You can never depend on this person, rely on this person. This person was just a, a, fa a fucking phony, running around sleeping with whores, catching STDs or getting people pregnant. Somebody's a loser. 
just straight up. And you broke and getting shit repossessed too. We have will, indecisive, allowing your life to um ramble aimlessly. Yeah, somebody's all, not on top of the wheel at all. And they just left their life. They just do whatever with their life. They're just reckless. And they wonder why their life goes like that. I'm getting, you're not, you make good decisions. You hit the nail on the head. You're blessed. Your ancestors protect you. Look at that protection the ancestors. They, this person can't fuck with you and nobody else on this earth can't either. Chair feels someone new is entering your life. Yeah, you have a new love. Like I said for you, this loyal heart with this masculine energy, your divine masculine is coming towards you. They're being guided to you with the C card. With the to the C, that's six of swords that's being guided. Yeah, you're going to co-create. You're going to have a child with this person. You're meant to have a baby with this person that's coming towards you. Okay? Just period, point blank. All right? We have frying pan, trouble, accusations. Yeah. Okay? We have um, teapot, deep friendship with someone of the same sex. Some of you have a deep friendship with someone. We have teardrops, great personal sorrow. I'm getting somebody's crying over you. They're heartbroken. We have cat, a two-faced friend. Yeah, this was someone who was two-faced and stabbed you in the back. Now they're crying and they're hurt. Okay, we have door. It says opportunities are waiting for you. Yeah, so many more opportunities coming towards you. We have Kane. Ray, pay attention to your health. Yeah, somebody's in very bad health. Very bad. We have kite vacation. Some of you are going on some kind of adventure. It could be to Paris or it could be to anywhere. But I'm getting a, a trip is coming up here soon for some of you. Could be in the month of January. Could be before that. We have happiness here and the happy, happy card here. So a lot of you are very happy in your lives or you're going to be. All right. We have gong. All right. An exciting event. Yeah, you're going to be very happy about this exciting event that's coming up or this trip. Or this person coming towards you, star. So we have star seed, star, and the star card in my deck here. So somebody's a huge star, or they're going to be. Somebody here is very, very, very gifted, very special. Okay? Very, very special. Y'all, I'm trying to show it to y'all. Here it is, star. We have star, star seed, and star card. Somebody's a fucking star here. A natural born star. Okay, and we have eggs. Success is sure with good plans and hard work. I'm getting you deserve this. You you planned well, you worked hard. Okay, and that's why this is here for you. Let's get a couple from Miss T Leaf deck too. Okay. Oracle deck, please. We have Nest. It says an emotion, emotionally secure, loving family is important to you. You're going to have an emotionally secure, loving family with this new love coming towards you. Okay? We have Sun. Yeah, happiness and well-being. You're getting a lot of happy cards. You're going to be very, very happy. I'm getting someone's going to get pregnant here with a boy or with twins. Okay, Kite. Yeah, that was already here. All right? I'm getting you're going to take a lot of trips with this love. I'm getting two stars coming together okay we have rooster an arrogant boastful person you should not cross yeah this arrogant person from the past has lost just period i'm getting somebody stupid and they and they their life is aimless okay we have apple okay it says temptation will test you yeah this person that got tempted by whatever okay we have butterfly, a change for the better. Yeah, I'm getting a lot of changes in your life. You change, you don't want this person. Fox, shrewdness and resourcefulness, especially in business. You feel like somebody is a, um, you feel like somebody's a clout chaser too. Somebody wants to r ride your coattail. But when you were shooting, in, they wasn't with you shooting in the fucking gym. When you was in the lab, they weren't there. They was out too busy out fucking around with hoes, getting them pregnant and doing all kinds of dirty shit. Okay, ham hock, taking a vacation physically, or I'm getting a big vacation coming up for you guys to somewhere sunny. I'm hearing California, Miami, Vegas. I'm just hearing um, some of you could be going to Paris. Some of you could be going to Dubai, whatever. We have yoke, feeling tied down or frustrated. Now somebody feels tied down in their life. They're broke. They're tied down. They're stuck to this person they chose over you or this person they chose to stay in a relationship with over you or whatever. Okay. We have carry your yeah, opportunity or windfall. I'm getting you. If you're a Libra and you're listening, play the lottery. Okay. We have worth sorrow over loss. 
Yeah, somebody is very, very sad about losing you here and the opportunity to be with you because you're very abundant. You're a star lily, spiritual love. Yeah, I'm getting you're about to. This was you were supposed to share a spiritual path with someone. They fucked that up. Now you're gonna have it with someone else that's really gonna treat you right. Be loyal to you, never raise a hand to you, never lie, never cheat, never con, never do any of that. They're gonna have the same respect for you you have for them. It says May. So the month of May could have been significant here. And then we have affairs with your family. All right. So some of you could be going through some family things here. I want to pull a couple cards from um, from this deck here. Our angel power tarot cards. Spirit is calling for me to pull from the archangel Michael. I mean, our angel deck. Okay. So we'll get a couple here and then we'll close this reading out. All right. What's the messages here for the collective? What's the messages here for the collective? Please, Spirit, what is the messages here for the collective? Spirit, guys, angels, universe, what's the messages here? To clarify this energy that's already here. Clarify this energy that's already here, Spirit. What's the messages? Clarify this energy that's already here. We have the King of Gabriel popping out. It says Gener generous, inspirational, dramatic, and driven. It says keep your eyes on the big picture. Leave the detail details to others. Experience experience that leads to success and genuine concern for others. So I'm getting that you you really you're really going you you really built something here for yourself. You got star here three times. You guys are stars. Are you up and coming stars? World renowned. Get ready for this. Get ready for this and get ready to meet the love of your life too. What's the messages here? Clarify this energy here for the collective. Clarify this energy here for the collective. We have nine of Raphael, okay? So this could be, um, this is uh, water, nine of cups, make a wish, dreams become reality, a joyful time of life. So I'm getting you're really taking action. You wish for this person, okay? Or you wish for this life and you're getting it. You know, you people make wishes. They don't always come true. I'm getting somebody here is is every wish they wish for is coming true. They're very chosen. Somebody's chosen, okay? So make a wish. Your dreams are coming true. We have the six of Gabriel. This is the six of wands. It says, congratulations. You've done a wonderful job. Time to move on to the next project. Awards, scholarships, and promotions, okay? So you're really, you really, yeah. I'm getting a lot of recognition here. A lot of followings. A lot of followers. What's the message to clarify this? Some of you could be dealing with... Uh, uh, Archangel Gabriel could be significant here. Yes, and he's out again. So Archangel Gabriel could be very significant for some of you. Some people, some, um, for some of you, Archangel Raphael, okay? So it says, Page of Gabriel, energetic, brave, optimistic, and playful. It says, follow your passion. You are ready for any challenge, opportunities for excitement and adventure. I'm getting somebody's gaining a following here. I'm getting someone's very attractive. I'm getting somebody's watching you too. For those of you who are in the public eye, there's another person that's in the public eye that is watching you, waiting to make their move towards you. What's the messages here for the collective? What's the messages here for the collective? Okay. All right. We have um, seven of Ari um, Ariel. All right. So this is a seven of coins. It says you have in you have invested wisely. Have patience and wait for the harvest. Review your progress and make plans for the next adventure. So whatever you invested in here, you made good decisions. We have our um, our angel Gabriel here again. So some of that for some of you, this person is important. This angel, this art angel. We have the four of Gabriel, four of wands. Time for a celebration. Abundant rewards for hard work. Release yourself from um, um, burdensome situations. You're about to get married here. Okay. Some of you are literally getting married under a gazebo like this and your family is there. This could be on a beach. A beach wedding is what I'm hearing. A private beach wedding is what you're going to have. Two celebrities coming together. Two people meant to come together by destiny. Two celebrities, two abundant people. I'm getting a Libra and an Aries. Okay. This is, could be these two people coming together. Or it could be because I'm hearing Libra heavy here. Okay. But I'm getting you really, you yeah, the Knight of Gabriel is here. Okay, time to take action. Great passion for, for a cause, instinctively knowing just what to do. Yeah, our angel Gabriel is here heavy, okay? Here he is again. 
the Knight of Michael and the Three of Gabriel. I'm getting somebody's been waiting to come towards you. The Five of Michael. I'm getting wow. So Gabriel is significant here. I'm getting art. I work very much with Archangel Michael, but Gabriel as well. Okay, those are the two Archangels I really resonate with. Ariel as well. Okay. So we have the three um three of Michael. That's the three of swords. Release the past. You will grow from the situation. Time heals all wounds. So yeah, there's an ex here or somebody from the past that wants to come in. It could be a Sagittarius. Okay, decision. Our angel Jophiel. Release your it says release yourself from that which holds you back. A need to detox, unnecessary worry based on a lack of self-confidence. So there's somebody worried here that they're not gonna be able to come back in. Yeah, nine of Gabriel, nine of Wands, this Sagittarius energy here. Okay, stay determined and, more and move forward. Be prepared for any possibility, environment, or active. I'm getting somebody's willing to come in and fight for you. They really are. The high priestess, yeah, our angel ha Haniel, okay? It's powerful, um, psych um, powerful psychic insights, reflection, and meditation that provides valuable information. Be at peace. I'm getting you're at peace. Somebody's a high priestess, a star, a spiritual guru. Someone's rushing in here. We have the five of Michael. The, this situation doesn't serve you. Release your attachment for the outcome. Consider taking a more uplifting approach. There's somebody jealous of you, an ex, somebody that hurt you purposely or tried to, somebody that's feeling defeated. This person won't let you go. They're, oh my God. Yeah, the the five of pentacles, somebody's in the cold, broke, not doing well. It says everything happens for a reason. Release regret and embrace the opportunities for happiness. So it's like somebody can't let go of the fact that they lost you. Somebody's in deep depression. They're sad. They're feeling defeated. Yeah. And all types of shit. Yeah, page of pentacles. An excellent opportunity will be offered to you. Scholarships or, or a pursuit of education. Time to get to it. Yeah, somebody feels like this is the page of pentacles. Somebody feels like you slipped through their hands. Like they can't seem to, they're stalking you, Page of Michael. That's Page of Swords. Yeah, you're at peace. It says release the past. There is more enriching. Um, there is more enriching future. There is a more enriching future coming. Let go and let go. You've let go and let God. You've let go. You know that you're that a better future is for you. You know that you're a star. You know that you're going to be famous. That you're going to be abundant. That you're going to be world renowned. You know that there's a better future. That you're going to get to truly be with the love of your life. And somebody else just can't let it go. Their page of swords, yeah, ten of Michael. We got the page of swords and ten of swords. This is someone who gossiped, stabbed you in the back, betrayed you, purposely did shit to try to break you and hurt you. And now they can't get over you. Now they can't let go. Yeah. Four of cups in the two of Gabriel. Somebody feels like they made a wrong decision. They, they missed out. They, and they want new beginnings with you, but I'm getting your nod. It says starting a new life, finding your purpose, a forgiving and compassionate review of the past. Yeah, somebody is now realizing that you were the one and that they fucked up. Yeah, two of Michael, two of but I'm getting you don't give a fuck anymore. I'm getting you have let go and you have let God literally let go and let God, okay? The color purple could be significant here. All right, somebody's a psychic and we have the 10 of Ariel. The Ten of Pentacles, yeah. There is so there is so very much to be grateful for. Financial success and the promise of retirement, a rich and rewarding family life. So you're you're gonna live a rich and rewarding family life with this new love that's coming towards you. Ten of Pentacles is the max pentacles. That's you. That's what's promised to you. Okay, it says promise of retirement and a re somebody building this psychic, the star, or whoever is building generational wealth here. Yeah, the chariot, determination, self-control, career advancement, acknowledgement, and success by others. Somebody's on their way to a lot of recognition and success. Eight of Ariel. Okay, this is the eight of pentacles. Yeah, you put in a lot of work and you deserve this. We have the eight of Raphael here. Okay. Okay. Which is the... um. Eight of Cups. Yeah, you've walked away in the world. Something is over. Yeah, you've spiritually grown here and you're realizing that the, your best decision is to move forward and go towards something better for yourself. Okay? So those are your messages. Make sure to like, comment, subscribe, and share this video. Bye.